Hey guys, XAXX here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Minecraft Forge um, uh, mod loader. So what this is, it is a Minecraft client that will allow mods. So as you can see, in all, as you've seen in all my other videos, I've been using mods, and I've been saying use Minecraft Forge, and you might be wondering what that is. So um, I've in the past, I've pre um, I've previously done this, um, this one of these videos um, in the past. And uh, I was just thinking of uh, redoing it for the new versions of Minecraft. So to get this, uh, to get Forge Mod Loader, you'll go to this page here. Um, I'll have it in the description, or you can just go to one of the other many websites on the internet, and you can find it. Um, so on the, when you're on this page, uh, you can scroll down, and then you will go to for Minecraft 1.8 if you if that's the version you're getting it for. You go to Installer and then the jar thing there and then it will come up with this page you press download and then once it's downloaded uh, you will open it downloads it's not opening finder uh, you'll open the download so uh, here it is forge uh, installer.jar now you open it and here here's a um, it'll come up with this paid uh, window here so you just keep it on install client. You don't touch any of that, um, all of any of that stuff there, because um, it's all set to install to the, um, uh, in the Minecraft folder and stuff. So just don't touch anything and press OK. And then, uh, oh, just before you, um, if you had an error message up here, it means that you have to uh, run the Minecraft 1.8 version already before doing this. So just make sure you've. Um, or run run the version of Minecraft that you're installing this for, but make sure you've done that. Um, and then once that's uh, installed, so it'll say it's successfully installed client profile Forge for version Forge blah 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 into launch and grab zero required libraries. That could be different depending on um, what your computer is and like stuff. Okay, uh, just like uh, if you've had Forge before and if you had Minecraft 1.8 before yet, or yeah, it just depends on what. It's you got it on your computer already. So once you've done that, you can press OK. Uh, you can quit that, and it's all done. So all you have to do is go into Minecraft, and then once this is loaded up, you can hurry up. Okay. So once this is all up, you go to Edit Profile. Release and then you can go to release 1.8 Forge. Um, I've got a few versions of Forge here, but you just go to the one that you installed. So release, it'll probably be somewhere up the top where you already are. But you go to release 1.8 Forge, then save profile and then play. So once that's all, um, once you've played with that and it's all loaded and the Minecraft game has loaded up, you can quit it. Um, so I'll show you um, once I've done it. But once it's all done. You can quit it, you can go into Finder, and you can go into your Minecraft folder, and the, there should be a new folder called Mods, um, so you can go in there, and then drag any mods that you want um, to use in here, and then they'll um, load up on your game if the mods are compatible with, with each other. Um, so that's pretty much all Forge does, it's a mod loader, it's, uh, I don't know who made it, sorry, but that person's really smart. Love them so much, like many other people. Um, but thank you so much for the person who made this. Um, so hope you enjoyed. I uh, hope this helps you. Uh, remember to like and subscribe. And yeah, have a good day. See ya.